Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Acres of Clay. I just wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all of you that blessed my birthday. There were so many of you, and I tried to respond to each one of you and just say thank you. I appreciate all of you more than you know. I had a great birthday. I'll throw a few clips in here to show you what we did on our birthday, on my birthday. Let's look at Kale. Oh, I see two calves. Two birthday calves. Let's see what they are. Well, aren't you cute? Yes, you are. Oh, shoot, you're a boy. What are you? Hey there. You're a girl. Good. You're cute, too. Is that your baby? Is that your baby? Okay. Oh, is that your baby? Okay, 2.15 had a girl, and 2.36 had a boy. Okay, I gotta remember that. 2.15, 2.36. I'm in the, uh, the Volvo today, riding in luxury. Usually I let Sydney drive this, just because, I don't know, he's good at backing this thing up. And, I don't know, he just likes driving it too. So I let him, even though it has a nicer seat. It's very comfy, very comfy. Um, and it has a radio, and it has air and heat. Although my, my Freightliner has air and heat, but it doesn't have a radio. And if it did, you wouldn't be able to hear it anyways. So, anyways, all right. Kevin and Ethan have already headed to the field. We only have a few more loads. We just ran out of time last night. So we're gonna finish that up this afternoon. Oh, I bet y'all wanted to see inside of here. This is the Artex. And it's got the chain unload. So that's, that's that. This is how much we gotta finish. There's a little bit area over there. Oh, looks like he's full. I better get down. Yeah, I'm sure he's gonna wait for me again. Whoops, where are you going? Well, this window is still dirty, just like all the other windows. But wow, it's quiet in here. Plus, I can see, I don't know if you guys can see, see it going? I can kind of see where, where it gets full. Yeah that, yeah, that window's not very clean either, but, but that's kind of neat. That's so neat. He's gonna take this. I'm gonna drive the Freightliner. Yep. Just gotta make sure this door latches. Oh, it's latched. Yeah. Go ahead. This is what our corn silage looks like. You can see the corn in it and the processor. Here, let me show you. When you see the corn, here, see this? This is what the processor is going to do. It's going to break that. It's going to break that corn up. As long as you have cracked corn or it's split or something, just as long as there's a, a nick out of it or cracked. Um, then the corn, then the cows will be able to digest it better, and in the long run, they will produce more milk off of it. I'll take over. Now you get to ride with me in the T 
tandem. All kinds of fun, huh? I think we're almost out. So we've got maybe three more loads and then we're gonna be completely finished with the 2020 harvest. I get back to the field after dumping my load. And what do I find? The guys are laying under the chopper. What's going on? Let's go find out. It's not even running. Oh, they plugged it. Plugged it? No, I think a belt broke. A belt broke? Oh. And I heard that one and then then we come in. Quit. Oh. Only a couple more loads. Well, hoping that will happen, but we're gonna get you on the wrong side again. Oh, yeah, I guess. Just got a face full of dry chaff. Feet and feet. Need help? Well, what you help with at the moment. You want to start it open first? Yeah, we ain't shut nothing. All right, can you pull that belt? Look at the corner. Oh, oh shoot. Wrong thing. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Ooh, that looks good. Uh, you gonna ride for a
on a nature walk hike. A nature hike? walk or hike? I don't know. I think it's just a, a tour, walk. touring the woods. Yeah. And the river. Yep. This is my birthday present. Yep, making her walk. Other than the manure spreader, which the manure spreader is a good birthday present. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this oh, is yeah, where we are? Hard. Yep. Come on, dear, you can do it. It's, it's your 41st birthday. All right, you gotta stand up now. What? Yeah, you gotta walk it. If it starts moving. I don't think it'll move anywhere. How much does it jiggle? It does. It does? Yeah, that's quite a tree. But what she gets to do for her 41st birthday. You remember how to get down? No. Uh. Can you help me? No. <laughs> just the same as you got up. There you go. There you go. Just slide down. There. You did well. Now just jump. It's only two foot. There you go. That's very true. Right Good. Actually, yeah, I think it is. That's a big, straight, huge thing. Watching the weather. We're weather. watching. We're watching the weather. The weather. The water. The sailboat. And walkers. And walkers. <laughs> so yeah. This is where he took me for my birthday, about 22 and a half years ago. Have been about that. Yeah. He proposed to me here. I did. Um, somewhere around here. We're not exact. We're not even exactly sure. It was somewhere here. Around. Here, your, your head's chopped off. You gotta get a little higher. Yeah. He's gonna take me out to eat, but he doesn't know where yet. Nope. I got an idea. That's cool. Did you catch anything? It's a sailboat. Oh. Only boat we've seen. Ethan made me a birthday cake, but I didn't get video of that. I came home from Kevin taking me out for the evening and he was making the cake then so it was still in the oven when we got home um, and then I was not hungry so we didn't actually eat the cake until the next day which is is good it was chocolate cake even though I'm not a big chocolate fan it's a good cake he knows I like it today's the day I'm gonna cover the silage pile at least we're getting it. It's really, really windy out, so I don't really know how well this is going to go. I would say wait another day, but I think Kevin wants to get it covered.
we're gonna wait. We have to wait till the wind dies down. Maybe this evening. I am heading out to the silage pile where the guys are where the guys are already working. I'm a little behind, but I need to get a pair of gloves because I don't like working with those tires without gloves. Yippee skippy, exciting day. You know what? Gotta get a pair of gloves though. I don't think it's as windy as it was yesterday morning when we first tried, um, but it still is a little breezy. So we'll see what it's like out on the pile. Ooh, the bright sun, it's nice. It's in the 70s today, so uh, feels good. I might not need this sweatshirt. Now today Ethan is, um, he's working up some ground, um, the corn that we've taken off he's, um, he's working up the ground so that we can plant some more rye here. So that's what he's going to be doing this morning, Kevin will probably plant, I don't think he's going to plant today but Ethan's getting everything ready. I'm going to run to the post office a minute while I'm out. Alright I will see you when I get back home. So I stopped to the post office and I got the cutest little birthday card. This is from a really dear friend. He had a sweet letter in there. It's such a great card. So, thank you.